Yeah. As y'all see that, we just got the car washes. Here she go. Yes, sir. We just got done doing the car washes. Right now, it's kind of chilly in Atlanta. Look at that car right there. Look at that car right there. It got so much stuff on it. We got the Hellcat. So listen, I'm trying to figure out if I should do this Tiffany Blue. I think I should. I don't know what the pool is to do what I do it though, so that's why I need y'all help me. Make sure y'all subscribe, make sure y'all like the comment, and make sure y'all push the like button. You feel me? But tell me what y'all think about the Tiffany blue color. And let me know what I, if I should do it. If you know what's up, I'm gonna do it. I was the first one that did it. Yes, I was, guys. <laughs> so we just got it cleaned up right now. We're about to get ready to go back to the house. Might eat some food, man. See what y'all think. Listen, I'm gonna get another five seconds to look at them. All right, that's enough, guys. That's enough, guys. That's enough, guys. <laughs> Can't let y'all see too much now, but we'll be back. I hope y'all like the video. Make sure y'all subscribe to me. Make sure y'all push that like button and make sure y'all comment below. So get at me. Eat bait. What's up, YouTube? Listen, we in the car right now. We in the big Hellcat, as, as I tell y'all. I own three Hellcats. Right now, we will be with two of them. We in Atlanta, Georgia right now. We will be with the third one is in Michigan, in Detroit. Um, we about to get out of this car wash. Um, so yeah, listen, I really want to do a wrap, but I got one of the hardest colors inside of Michigan. Like one of the hardest cats. Colors, so I say the hardest cat colors <laughs> inside of in Detroit, Michigan, or Michigan period. I got Smoke Show. Nobody messing with Smoke Show. Smoke Show is one of the best um, colors that you can possibly get in the Hellcat. Um, so I was trying to see if I even should wrap it or I should, um, to, I want to wrap it. Tiffany, man, you know what? I'm not even gonna say that much. I want to wrap it. So I'm trying to figure out if I should wrap it the color that I want to, or I should just leave a cutter on. Y'all should let me know. Make sure y'all comment. Make sure y'all hit the like button. Make sure that y'all subscribe to my channel. Um, I meant to give y'all a preview when I first bought the car. I bought the car probably last week. It's probably like five days I bought the car. I already drove it to Atlanta. I bought it brand new. So I'm just trying to see if I should um, redo, like reissue or redo a, a, a take home, should I say take home type of blog. You know what, never mind, scratch that. <laughs> but um, yeah, YouTubers, I'm a full-time YouTuber now. Yes, sir. Um, you can definitely subscribe to eBaby Garage. And I'm sorry, y'all keep looking the other way because I'm driving right now, going back to the house. And we're just trying to see what, what, what should I do next to the car? Should I put the lights on there? Should I should I put the stars in here? Because I'm thinking about putting the stars all inside the, the car. So I want to know what y'all think. Should I do it or should I just leave it alone or should I make it a race car? The fastest wide body Hellcat in the world. <laughs> I could have got a red eye. I didn't want a red eye. I, oh, let me tell you about that. Everybody asked me, if you got three Hellcats, why you didn't get a red eye? I didn't get a red eye, it's, it's for multiple reasons. First one reason I didn't get a um, red eye charger. Let me put that out there, the red eye charger, because I love chargers. I also got one Challenger, but I love chargers. Um, I, I didn't get a, a red eye, is because first, I just didn't feel like paying $1,400 a month. For a car when I could pay fourteen hundred dollars for a house that's like three hundred thousand dollars <laughs> so I just didn't understand the point of paying money for a car when they all do the same thing they look just alike they got the same exact mom the, the fucking same exact buttons are in every charger and well the newer is what should I say and only thing they got different than me is they got a 797 I got 700 I don't think I got to do is put a small pulley and some other more mods in and I'll be exactly at that 
So I just didn't understand me. I just didn't understand the paying fourteen hundred dollars a month. Also, I'm, I didn't get it because it seemed like every time that I get something that's brand new that just just come out, they always seems to mess up. And when I seem by when I mean by messing up, it always seems to something always get wrong with them. Like um, like my engine lighter come on, my engine light don't come on, um, the traction or if the traction started messing up, the suspension it wasn't correctly. So I always don't, I never get the cars that just, just, just come out. I always wait till like a few months to say fix all the errors and then get the vehicle. But um, that's what I do. I could have got the red eye. I could have been had the red eye. I could still get the red eye. I just, I just don't want it, you know? So I will leave that to everybody else. You know, I don't know how y'all financial problems is. Mine's is great, but it's still I'm not dumb enough to pay fourteen hundred dollars a month when I can pay like seven hundred dollars, eight hundred dollars for my Hellcat and probably lower. You know, so it just didn't just didn't make no sense. So um, that was the crazy part. But um, so I don't know. That's the one of the one. That was the reason why I didn't didn't think about getting the red eye. I can still get a red eye to this day, so <laughs> I just don't want it. Um, I like my charger that I got right now. I got the hardest charger. Let me see. Let me see. Look how this look. Let me see how this look. And I don't know if y'all can see it or not, but y'all see that? One of the hardest chargers behind me. That's my baby right there. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can see it, but if y'all can, y'all see I got one of the hardest chargers. But, so yeah, let me put this back up here. But yeah, that's one of the reasons, guys. So I'm out of here. Make sure y'all push the like button. Make sure y'all subscribe and make sure you don't comment below. What should I do to the Hellcats next? I got the um, Hellcat behind me that looks so good. Like, so, so good, guys. Look at this. <laughs> look how beautiful she look she looks super good <laughs> but I don't know y'all tell me what should I do should I even bother getting doing any mods or should I just you know um, leave it alone I wish, I wish, man, listen, I had got the Hellcat. I want to tell y'all this story real quick before I get up out of here. I had grabbed this Hellcat a couple days ago. I love the Hellcat. Um, I only had it for about, like, I want to say two days, three days. And um, I ended up going down a street, um, police team that I had the Hellcat. And if you've been in Detroit, you know Detroit, you watch about the Detroit car scenes, y'all know that Detroit car scenes always seems to um, get very wild. <laughs> very, 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 very wild. So the police end up pulling me out. As the police pull me out, they end up um, um, searching my vehicle, thinking that my car's stolen. So as they're thinking that my car's stolen, I basically told them it wasn't stolen. They end up lifting my hood up. They end up popping my um, popping my opening up my door, looking at my VIN numbers. They said that my license, driver license, was stolen or fake. Should I say? Excuse me. They said my driver license was fake, and it don't come up nothing. <laughs> I didn't understand that. I think they were just trying to see if the car was stolen because they didn't have no probable cause any at all. You know, they trying to say that the the Supreme Court ruled that they don't have no they don't have to have no reason to get you out the vehicle no probable cause at all to get you out the vehicle and the traffic stop so i don't know but do i want them problems i think i do i do i definitely want them problems and i'm gonna continue keep, keep continue having them problems because i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna enjoy my hellcat even if the police bother me so uh, let me know get at me i'm out of here Hmm. 
<laughs> Y'all like my hell, my hell cat chain? <laughs> yes. Shout out to my YouTube. YouTube? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Shout out to my YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> this is the guy behind the camera, y'all. This is the guy that make everything happen for me. They edited everything. They catch everything. You know. Yes, sir. You know, what channel should they subscribe to? Both of them. E Baby Garage and Carmel Down Studios. Yes, sir. <laughs> Sleepy right there. You got a YouTube yet, man? Hold on, you ain't get that bitch going yet. He ain't get it going yet, but you got an Instagram? You can put this on my Instagram. <laughs> 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 Subscribe, sleep is for the rich 23. Yeah, yes, sleep is sir. for the rich is 23. So make sure y'all subscribe to his channel and to his YouTube when he get one. And make sure y'all subscribe to his Instagram. You know? We out of here. Ebay!